Hi, everybody. I'm Blake Cabot. I am the owner of facepaint.com. And this is a product demo of Linnea's beautiful palette that she created. This is going to be about the, uh, what Jesus, it's going to be the transform palette that she did. And she did it so long ago, she's forgotten actually when she did it. But uh, it's a fabulous palette. Uh, we're going to have it at uh, the Max Convention in St. Louis. If you guys are there, you can buy it there. Uh, you can buy it here. Uh, I'll give you a discount code in a little bit. Uh, but uh, Lenny, take away. Thank you, Blake. Hello, everyone. I'm back again. And now for some new product news from Craze. Um, I want to show you all my latest palette, and it is called Transform Palette. And it is a perfect palette for all those boy designs and you can transform them into anything they want with these colors so i want to know where you're all from it's always fun to see so please type in where you're from and get sure. your um, um let's get okay. it started i'm going to show you the palette okay there I'll turn it off is. The, your video so here it is. There it is. A thing of beauty. Uh, Hello, UK. So beautiful. Hello, it's Hello, called Pennsylvania. Hello. Hello. Uh, this uh, palette is so gorgeous. The colors are so bright. And oh, I, I love it. Uh, when I created this palette, I wanted to have a it was going to be like a color explosion. And I wanted to have great colors to make designs that I often make uh, for the boys. So there is a part of every each of these uh, cakes here. So here are some one's throat. And uh, down here, we got some single colors. Berkshire's and I'm going to tell you all Colorado. the names. You can Hello. ask New Jersey, uh, Bonnie Lake, Washington. Hello, everyone. So, uh, this palette, all the cakes are easy to just to lift out when you like loading it, and then you can easily put them back in place. And you also got two brushes, mm -hmm. um, a little flat brush here, and then a number three round brush. Yes, extra. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to show some swatches with these. And oh, I sure. uh, I really hope you are going to love them as much as I do. So we're going to start with this one. This one is the one stroke with like uh, black, gray, a little bit of silver and white in it and it is called robot here is a link look... to the palette if you guys want to see it and it's and gonna something like this. i'm going to create a coupon code within seconds great we love discounts blake <laughs> everyone does you know i, I like them too <laughs> uh, i gotta say they're not bad so i'm going to show start with this one robot and let me show you. Is the paint vegan friendly? Yeah, I think it is. Um... Oh, and I wanted to show you. Uh, I showed you last time with the other palette. It, so... it actually went. It, it 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 is it's it's vegan. Yeah. This palette is uh, yeah. no neon in it, so it's uh, no Super neon. This uh, palette. There we go. Okay, I'm going to tell you all the names very quickly before I make... Uh... Yeah, I should probably know this. Yeah. <laughs> so, this one is Robot. Mm -hmm. This one is called Hero. This one is Flames, Reptile, Lightning, and Magic. And for the single colors, we got black and white, of course. It's, it's a must. And then we get Blue Steel. Uh, silver metal, 
Red Hot Chili, Graffiti Orange, Slime Green, Go Bananas, Leather Brown, and Golden Trophy. Okay. Ah, okay. So I'm going to start with showing you the fruit that I called Robots. Okay. And I'm going to show you with a, a one inch brush. Yes, so you can see the whole uh, cake. Okay. But of course, you can use a three quarter inch if you don't want the lightest part or if you don't want the darkest part, it's okay. If you want to use a, a half inch brush, you will get like the middle of it. Okay. And I have put a lot of uh, time and love into this palette to get the best combinations for me. Okay. So, so this, um, you can create a lot of cool stuff. You can use it like for dragons, spider webs, robots, skulls, uh, horns, uh, astronauts, okay. anything black and white. So... Okay. You can get that 20% off Ooh, for the next two days. That's nice. And here's the code. So uh, it's very easy. You can like, uh, for this, you can create a, like a Spider-Man eye if you want. Uh -huh. Very easy. You can have it for the wiggly modes when you're doing like a, maybe if you're doing like a, Wow. Spider-Man design, or if you're making it for for a dragon, mm -hmm. okay, you can have it for a nice spider webs like this, and uh, you can also um, maybe you want to do like a um, like a Millennium Falcon. You know I love Star Wars. So. I know you do. It's yeah. uh, it's a little strange, honestly. No, it's not strange. It's I love cool. Star Wars. I love Marvel. I love I love uh, sci-fi. Anything. I, I'm a little bit of a geek, you know. <laughs> oh, Amy Lou, I wish I was a face painter. I actually <laughs> did learn face painting. I, so, uh, someone needs to take me a, 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 by the scruff of the neck at Max and actually just make me do it. But I've watched a lot of face painting, like a lot, hundreds of hours of face painting. I've, I've probably watched more face painting than anybody else here. I haven't done any of it, but I've watched a ton of it. You can even use it for roses. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> you yeah. could. Hello. So it's a, it's a, it's a very good uh, color. Robot, this is called. And... Uh, it's also very it's also very cute to make space designs with it. Like if you're doing like a if you're making an astronaut helmet, it's it's a very good like this. Geeks of the world unite. Well, I couldn't agree more. So you can create cool stuff with it. Okay. I think that's true, Amy Lou. Once you pick up a brush, you can't put it down. I think I'm I'm <laughs> I'm I'm gonna get there. I really am. Um I just never I I it's a fear factor. I gotta admit it. It's a fear factor. I'm scared. The next one is the blue oh. one. It's called Hero and it's got a little bit of shimmering in it. I love to have some shimmering effects in my blue uh, cakes, uh -huh. it makes it a little bit like, a little bit more metal uh, feeling, like a helmet. So mm -hmm. Perfect for um, like uh, uh, superhero designs, like Captain America, or you can make mm -hmm. it like for uh, uh, sharks, uh, dragons, or uh, pirates, or anything. Anything. Uh, it can look something like I just painted this on ordinary paper. It's always more vibrant on skin, but 
I wanted to show you very uh, quick some uh, things you can create with it. It's a very, very nice color. Mm -hmm. Awesome. For you. Um, one thing, if uh, I'm thinking about creating a face painting school, and uh, I've got a group going for a kind of a discussion. So if any of you guys are interested, wanting to kind of give me your feedback about what the school might look like, I would really appreciate it. So there is the link to the face paint group. Face paint school discussion is really what it is. Mm -hmm. Um, okay. So this, um, it's, uh, it's, it's a very good, um, to making like, uh, Captain America. I don't know if you all saw the, the fifth online summit. I used the, this cake for the Captain America mask that I did there. So it, it's a very good, uh, color for it. Mm -hmm. And you can also, I'm going to show you. Like you can see, it's a. It's a very, very, very nice. A little bit shimmering on it. It's very cute. And then. like make some uh, some uh, sharks of it if you want yep oh i'd still keep doing the webinars i wouldn't stop doing this i have too much fun doing it kind of defines my week <laughs> okay so it's it's a blue one mm -hmm. the hero That's okay it's a very nice blue. Yep. Show you I mean. On screen. It's a very, very nice blue color. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh it's it's very close to DFX and tag. Yeah. They're both wax based paints. They're I think they actually come from the same manufacturer. So yeah, they're very close. Now I'm going to show you one of my favorites. It's this one. It is called Flames. And I tried so many combinations before I found the one. So this is my number one for fire flames or anything. It can look something like this. It makes so beautiful. Um, Fire flames. Uh huh. And what are those colors? I guess um, black, red, orange, yellow, white. It's not. It's not orange. It's. I don't know exactly, that, but it's not orange. It's more like a little bit of peach, orange kind of. Mm -hmm. It's something. It, it's not orange. It's blue orange on the screen but in real life it's not typical orange okay and would you uh, use I really like iron man yes uh, for iron man i have of course put some gold in here i love to use uh, the gold and there's also some gold in this so you can make the yellow gold details with with the lightning and then you can use um just skip the maybe the lightest part and use this one for uh, for contours and then you can uh, use the uh, the red hot chili to fill in the bigger parts i have think of it all <laughs> what haven't you thought of what haven't you thought of i asked myself <laughs> you know i love iron man it's my favorite <laughs> You love Star Wars. You love Iron Man. Oh, yeah. What do you hate, Linnea? What do you hate? Like if someone oh. says, do this design, you think, oh, really? 
always when some when like 12 uh, girls come up and all they want is unicorns i'm like oh no can't i just paint a spider or something <laughs> uh will you show the shark again please they do want to see it uh, yeah i'm glad iris that you love this webinar i love having you here buenas tardes hello mexico there we go there's a shark <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to show you this. And also, so always when I do like uh, like a football or basketball, I, I love to add some fire flames to it. I think oh, Kim good. says anything that you have to repeat over and over is dreadful. <laughs> yes, <laughs> when always the I was at the birthday party last uh, week. And I added a new uh, a new uh, design option on my board. It's like a disco ball with glitter. And the birthday girl chose it. And then after that, it was seven more girls choosing the exact same thing. <laughs> like, oh, no. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Uh oh. We have all been there, you know. <laughs> Unicorn party and... So, like, if you're making like a. Uh, what number is the flat brush? Uh, this is a num uh, one inch. Okay. It's just so I can show you the whole color. Uh, when I'm painting a child, I often use a three quarter inch. I think it's right. a great size for the kids. Uh, if it is a very very small kid, I will use a five eight. Mm -hmm. uh, but. Three quarter is the one I use the most uh, for rainbows and for like uh, decolletage or anything. I can use a one inch. But today I'm going to show you with a one inch because if I will just use this, I would not show you the whole cake. So that's why I'm using this one today. So well, thank you going for to be a little bit the cake. palette. I appreciate it. Um, sometimes I ask if they like to change sometimes i ask if they'd like to change up the colors at least like a different color butterfly or unicorn that's a good yes <laughs> and they're like no i want the same as emma okay <laughs> and uh, so for fire flames hi kim I think it's Kim. I'm logged in as Crazy FX, so it's got to be Kim. She's watching this. That's funny. Mm. You do nice stroke. That is pretty. That is very pretty. It's a very nice. Um... It's a very nice. Uh, that would be a very cool, a basketball. That would be a very cool basketball design. Yeah, that's right. I love that's a, you got it. My son is playing basketball, so um, he really like it. You know, all all things about basketballs. Mm -hmm. Do -do -do. So it was the flames. And I always like to do the spiders with this as well. Uh -huh. But you know, in skin, it looks even more vibrant than uh, than here. Uh, can you get the main one stroke separately or only as the palette at the moment? Only as the palette right now. Is that a true statement? I think that's a true statement. We got your last palette, individual cakes, right, Linnea? Yes, the flower bouquet palette. Yeah, uh, we, we, we got um, those, but right now all you can do is get it as a palette, I'm afraid. Yes. And what so brush were you using again? Sorry. One inch, um, one inch uh, angled brush. And what, what was the brand? Uh, this is uh, from Holland. Okay. Yes. 
I'm glad you love the split cake. And I'm going to show you the the third one. Uh -huh. This one, it's called reptile. Mm -hmm. So it's got a lot of sort of uh, different greens in it. And it would be great for all your uh, like dinosaurs, snakes, dragons, even the Hulk. Uh, like you can use it for a lot of cool stuff. Mm -hmm. So it can look something like, like these. Wow, cool. It's a very I just love nice. Seeing this. Hey, Zuri. <laughs> yeah, my phone goes off every time. It's just a total gas. Sorry, moment aside. Um, beautiful, beautiful split cake. Beautiful Sorry. No, oh, thank you. Yeah. Now my version. <laughs> so the palette is great because you get every colors you need um, for the boys. And you get to try some new fun paints, of course. Mm -hmm. This one can look something like a... Thanks, Iris, for joining the uh, face paint school this... discussion. Cute for the for the little uh, snakes, you know. Yeah, you get the point. So, so this is the green one. Reptile. Mm -hmm. Of course, you have to have a green one. You know, the, the boys love the dragons. I can show you. I can't stop. You know, when I when I started. This one is perfect as well for. Uh, Hello, California. It's a great green one. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to show you the yellow one. This one. It's called Light Thing. And uh, my oh. first thought of it was I wanted to have something with uh, yellow and a little bit of gold and I wanted to have it black but I wanted the most of it to be yellow so it would be right really bright and uh, I love to use this for all the Pokemon Pikachu uh, and you can also use it like for lightnings and for prince crowns and stars everything so um, it can look something like this when it's lightning. Okay. I'm going to show you. You can see it. It's It's great also for like Wonder Woman crowns and uh, stuff like that. I'm going to show you like if you're making like a, like a crown. Um, or if you're making like lightnings. Mm -hmm. oh, 
for Facebook making up. says, beautiful, great job. Thank you. Uh, Iris comes in late. Uh, Iris, yeah, this is a new paste painting palette. It's called the Transform Palette. And it's uh, I it is it is a new craze palette. I'll, I'll, the link is in the chat notes. Um, so if you need it, and we also have a discount code called Transform Twenty, I believe. So um, that is uh, yeah, that would be great if you'd buy it. And if you guys are going to be in St. Louis, we'll be selling them there too. And it's also because of that it got so much yellow and a little bit of gold in it. It's perfect when you're making like Bumblebee from Transformers or if you're making like Iron Man to just have it like a like mm -hmm. a stroke. It's great for those. Okay. Yeah, it's a very pretty yellow. It's a must. <laughs> yeah. So that one was lightning. Uh -huh. and now I'm going to show you this one. It's called Magic. I wanted to have something for, uh, because my son, he loves Harry Potter and he loves everything with space and mm -hmm. he loves uh, Marvel, Black Panther, you know. So he wanted, I wanted to have something that isn't the typical red, blue, green. I wanted to have something with a more shimmering and with a little bit of like purple, blue, silver, and of course the, the lighter color and the darker color. So you can make nice magic swirls or galaxy paints with it. You can use it like also for Batman and for cool um, spiders or anything like that. Okay, I'm going to show you how it looks. It can look, it can look like this. It's quite dark here because it's uh, nine thirty in the evening here in Sweden. In the sun, it looks cool. Uh, you can buy it on facepaint.com um, because, um, yeah, that, that's where you can buy it, uh, Maria. So don't plan on SO upgrade. I think that's what this says too. And I think I have a link a little higher up, but I can always give it to you again. Here you go. So you as well some. Man. And you get to see pictures of Linnea's child on that uh, product. Because we've got, I think it's your child. Yes, he looks, Jack. He looks, he mm -hmm. looks cute and blonde. Uh, that, that right? Yes, yes it's my boy, Jack. Where do you buy these rainbows? Well, where do you, where can you, can you buy a rainbow? I don't know. Rainbows aren't for sale. But you can buy this one there. Ivy. Like if you want it a little bit more dark, you can use like a, this, this is a five for eight paints. Yes, that's true. Below DC.
So if you're using um, with the darker one, with a little smaller brush, it's also great when you're making like a, like the Black Panther design or anything. And if you want to have a little bit bright, show you. You just skip the black part of it. You just place it a little bit further down. Like this. Right. You, you will have a, a great color for, for Galaxy. Mm -hmm. Or if you're making like a like a Harry Potter design, you maybe want to have some some magic to it. And then you can paint like a like a little wand here. And some uh, stars and glitter on it. Maybe you can have the HP log to it or some glasses. Anything okay? <laughs> yep, makes sense. You made it okay. So it's, it's the magic ball. Okay, so now I have showed you the this one strokes, and now I'm going to show you the simple colors. Okay, and I'm going to show you easy with some. Finger sponges. I start. I can start with this one. Mm -hmm. This one on top here, the brown one, is called leather brown. Perfect for all your like, if you're making a. Captain America and you want to have the leather details on it or if you're making like a, like a bear, you can use it or for your, for your lion mane or anything. So look like this. And if you combine these two, it's also beautiful together. Okay. And with the the gold, golden trophy, it's very shimmering, which I love, of course. Perfect for Iron Man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And for your sport designs, if you want like a trophy or anything. Looks like. Like this. Bad. So, leather brown and golden trophy. Now I'm going to show you. This is the green one called slime green, and the yellow one is called go bananas. Uh -huh. You have to know that it took me the same amount of time to come up with the names. Than to make the paints, actual paints. <laughs> All my friends had to vote for the names. <laughs> <laughs> you got your friends to do this? Yep. Oh, dear Lord. My favorite <laughs> uh, marketing disaster moment uh, I remember from uh, business school was uh, somebody translated a vacuum. Uh, an ad for Electrolux from Swedish to from German to Swedish to English or something like that. And mm -hmm. eventually it, 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 it eventually became nothing sucks like Electrolux. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Which I'm a little afraid now you've given all these names that uh, 
I don't know. I don't think that's really a problem with the word yellow. <laughs> There is the aligned green. I wanted to have a really nice aligned green. Perfect for all your like Ghostbusters designs, or if you're making a graffiti designs, and or if you want a little lighter scale for your dragons. This is great. Mm -hmm. Okay. And and we got the Go Bananas. Lovely name, right? And this one is also perfect for like stars or if you want to fill in your Pikachu or for anything. Mm -hmm. Anything yellow. Okay. And, yellow. and of course, I put them together so you can easily combine them if you want something cool with it. Sounds fantastic. And now we have we got about 20 minutes left. It's okay. And now we got the red hot chili. And here is graffiti orange. Mm-hmm. Start with the graffiti orange. Mm -hmm. There it is. Perfect for all your details when you're making like a, a graffiti designs or anything. You have to have an orange in it. Mm -hmm. And for the red one, red hot chili. Okay. It's a great red for your Spider Man, so if you're doing a uh, any like lizards and want to have a really strong tongue or anything. And uh -huh. um, all your details. Okay. And Iron Man. <laughs> and here is the blue steel and the silver metal. It's very, very shimmering. I use a lot of silver and gold for my board designs. I like to use to use it, and I love I love to use um uh, some little bit of shimmer in it. And I always, always, always ask the boys if they want glitter or not because uh, a lot of boys love glitter as well. More glitter to the people, okay. Here's the blue steel. It was my husband's uh, choice of name. He had to name one of them. So he took the blue. <laughs> you got him in this? Nice. <laughs> he, he was like, I also want to be a part of the palette. Okay. Then. Here it is. It is a great color to do your sharks or Captain America or everything that is blue. Okay. I'm going to show you the, the silver. The silver is great for like bumblebee or and and when I say bumblebee, I mean, I mean not not the insect. I mean the transformer bumblebee. I hope you understand that. Okay. 
uh, and for anything that is silver, sport designs or uh, details on your Batman or anything. So, blue steel and thank you very much and of course there's no palette without the basic black and white you really got to use black and white black and white and red all over i love to <laughs> use the white pieces. details on anything so that's why they're a bit bigger than the other so white a very strong white for that one uh -huh. And of course, we needed a a strong black. All your details. Okay. So uh -huh. that was the transform palette. There's the transform palette, everybody. You have seen it all. Okay. You've seen it all, and I really hope that you are in. We'll try it and enjoy it and uh, use that uh, discount code. It's Absolutely. Perfect for yeah. try some new stuff. Transform <laughs> 20 capital T on facepaint.com. It is all yours for Linnea's wonderful palette. Linnea, it has been um, just fabulous to have you uh, design all these wonderful products. And uh, oh, the amount of thank you, Blake. It's and, been so uh, much fun. It was uh, it was fabulous, um, and uh, so thank you very much, uh, everybody. Uh, we will be back uh, next week. Oh no, not next week. What am I saying? What am I mad? I'm going to be at the, the the convention next week. Uh, we'll be back with Irene Melvin on the 29th. Um, so and we'll be doing cartoon designs, and then we'll have. Um, uh, we'll be doing, uh, Amanda Carriford was going to be doing a demo of her hub angle brushes, face painting hubs, angle brushes on May 2nd. So, okay, guys, uh, the code again is transform 20. So that is it. Okay. Thank you very much and have a good evening. Good day. And thank you everyone. Bye.